And now I'm going to open the, the image of the South Turkey. Lancet with a little file. And this is the image of the turkey. Satellite image. And I'm going to specify my study area by an ROI. I don't want to rename this. Just I'm going to apply the radiometric and atmosphere correction. I'm going to apply this special subset. Okay. Turkey radiometric. Okay. Now reciparing this build. So I'm going to apply a quick atmospheric correction to get a better result. Yes, Turkey, answer to LI, and OK. Now, this is as much correctly corrected image. And as you see, this all this area that exposes that of getting fire. So now I turn off this layer and now go to through the spectral lenses. Quark atmosphere correction and through the normalized burn rash. Did you see all these areas specified as a born area? When I check out the quick statistics, and the values are between minus one and plus one. So you can check the values. of the area all these values are just under the zero for example now I'm going to apply a threshold to specify the exact area values and there's a zero in these areas 
considered uh, as a bushfire area or as a locations that have gotten fired. So I'm going to apply another threshold. that you see it's better now. So now I'm going to check the exact value. For example, it's under the 2.47. And now I'm going to open the decision tree. New decision tree. B1. All is in equal to minus zero point two five seven. Okay. this one and specify a color red okay and execute bushfire Now I close all this. I open the file, bushfire. Now here we have just two classes. The class value of the one in the class value of the I click here uh, metadata or let me edit metadata I'm going to add Let me check out from here NV header data ignore. So in here I'm going to type zero. And apply OK. And now we have the only born area here.
not anymore. And from here, classification to victor, bushfire, okay. Only this one, class one. From here, board area. Okay. It's going to be to into the a vector file uh, EBF that is only supported by NV. And I'm going to open this from here. Born area. Yes. I'm going to export this into classification. No, EVF to shape file. Now I select my EVF file. And from here, I'm going to specify a destination. For example, board. Now the shape file is created. We can open in the, the create a shape file into the GIS and edit or apply any other processing. So from here, NV lens preprocessing board SHP. This is our created shape file that you can dissolve and apply any analysis here. Okay, thanks for watching this video and wish you enjoy the tutorials. Thank you.